Hey everybody, I am at the Spellbinders booth. I am just going to go over some of the products they have here. So they have some Glimmer Hot Foil. You guys know that I just did the uh, Glimmer, this um, Glimmer Plate Hot Foil system. It's pretty amazing. We have new Hot Foil uh, plates here. And their cards are just amazing. Got cards up here. I'll try to go slow. And then these are really nice for cards. Love them. All right, so these are cut and emboss in one. Oh, that's awesome. So it's like a, a die and an embossing folder. So it kind of looks like that. It's pretty cool. Got some die or some cards here. So pretty. Up here. Love them. All right, then we have Jane Davenport. Stamp, sorry for the glare. Love her stamps, they're so cute. And then some dies up here. More stamp and dies. And then we got some more dies down here. And then these here. Oh, you're good. <laughs> and then these go in the Glimmer Hot Foil system. Oh, these are so pretty. Got some cards here. Oh, look at this one. Oh, these are from Yana. Love these. So pretty. Oh, look at this one. That's so cool. The card. Beautiful. Hi there, I'm Becca Beacon with Amazing Paper Grace. I'm a licensed Spellbinders designer and I've got three new collections that are coming to market. I'd love to show you. So the first on the list is 3D Vignette Mini Albums. And 3D Vignettes is a card style that I develop that collapses, it's a 3D card that collapses into a flat card for mailing. And now I've created it so that it's either a card or it's a mini album. And so you can put all the different embellishments inside it, but just as easy as it is to do that, you can do a card. And the magic behind this is a universal spine. That's one of the corner pieces of the collection that let you be able to um, create stable pages that will turn and they're fairly fluid. And so if you look at some of the older dies with 3D vignette, this is the first 3D vignette that had an open aperture that you could see in, but I, I made it into a little scrapbook here. And it, it here again, the magic is the universal hinge. And so the collection is all things that can go inside the album, but just as they go in an album, you can put them on any flat card. For instance, this is a card made with one of the shape pieces and, and the interior pieces. And um, then also with this collection, I developed a flower that is both dimensional and flat. So here it's dimensional, and then here it's flat. Yay. Beautiful. Okay, so then we also have Candlewick Classics, square, circle, oval, and a rectangle for card making and layering. And then there are two character dies that go along with that set as well. And this is the kind of thing that you, you know, it's going to give you the opportunity to have a sentiment, or you can layer them just endlessly. So it's a whole set of those. Beautiful. And then two more. I have florist fretwork. And so on florist fretwork, 
the idea behind it was you want a place for a sentiment, but you also want things that will do layering. And so you have both here with the, all of these series of rims. You can either have a shadow piece or you can have a whole background piece that pretty much does the card for you. So along with that, there's a Swiss Army knife set of sentiments and a, a motif so that you can do those quick go-to cards that you need in a hurry. And then last but not least, we have Dimensional Doilies, which is a new take on doilies. What happens is um, the motifs are cut several times and then they're linked together. The way that they're linked, they raise up and they create another layer. So you get layers of doilies and not only do you get the pattern but you also get a shadow and so if you can just imagine offsetting that you get a lot of different depth and it's just it's a very different look and so those are like modular pieces but we give you enough that you can quickly cut a card link them and you're you're off it's just something different beautiful so that's my offerings for um for this go round and i think that they're inviting and i hope i'm enabling you to just try something different in your card making thank you <laughs> thank you so much for watching this video from creativation 2020 if you want more videos from creativation be sure to check out the playlist on my channel if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and leave me a comment down below thanks so much for watching Bye.